It's Jurassic Park Operation Genesis. Oh yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I don't have a loop. You know what? You know what? I'm still waiting for people to come in here. Are those two people still walking in? Yeah, they are. They're still lost. Oh, it's, con it's contagious, this thing. I think these people need rescuing. Is my cleaner going to get stuck as well? Come on, Steven. All my guests are walking in circles. Why are all my guests walking in circles? What is going on? And so many of my guests need the toilet. Oop, oop. No, that's a cleaner. Come on, somebody wants to go on the safari ride, surely. Nobody, not one person is going to go on the safari ride. It's like the thing is not even here. Yes, come on, Chris. You know you want to, Chris. Yeah! Alright. Right. I'm going to use the sedate function this time. If this isn't enough, then we uh, may have to add in a few more carnivores. When they're not rampaging, they should go down in one in one shot. I'm a little wary. Come on, it, it's eating. It's that's got to be thrilling, right? Eating the cow. Right? Are you going to attack the jeep? No, you're going to stay over there. That's perfectly fine. Feel free to do that. And you? Yeah, come on. That's got to get some thrills up, surely. There we go. Well done. You have built a park which will no doubt satisfy the thrill seekers in the Danger Club. Let's hope they live long enough to enjoy it. Feel free to continue managing this park or head back for some other challenges InGen has waiting for you. Well, I really didn't need to end the previous video. <laughs> oh well. What I needed to do was just go on for like another two minutes. Oh well. Alright, so we have to wait now for this thing to come back around. Oh, stay there. Stay there. No, 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 no. Just land it in because at least that didn't stop it. Yeah. <laughs> All we have to do is just shut the thing down once and then hopefully we'll be okay. I am very, very nervous about the placement of this Acrocanthosaurus right now. Yeah, just just sift the ground. Feel free to do that. No, 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 no. <laughs> okay, you're going for a drink. It's fine, I don't mind you doing that. Alright everybody. This ride is now closed. Permanently. Yes, I know. I can do that now. Right, let's get a team up here. How are these guys doing? Average. Not one bit of Spinosaurus stuff yet, though. No problem. It's not really getting me anything useful. I mean, there's the herbivores, so we do have the herbivores. Tyrannosaurus, Acrocanthosaurus, Tyrannosaurus. What on earth is a Spinosaurus? How the? What? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Why is that? Though that that can still be there. I close the ride. Why is that still there? Is that Acrocanthosaurus still sedated? Yeah, it is. That Acrocanthosaurus is going to be right in the way. Uh, yeah, so, so the Acrocanthosaurus is going to be right in the way. Oh, you get out of the way first. I am not confident enough. Yeah. I ain't got that confidence. Right. 
Let's move you out of the way. The Cacarodontosaurus can stay there. I closed the ride. Why is it still letting people out? It should not still be going. So hopefully the Cacarodontosaurus is going to be fine just there. You go back over there. The Cacarodontosaurus will wake up eventually. The Acrocanthosaurus is already up. You keep walking that way. No, 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 no. You stay there. <laughs> I just love how they slide along the ground. Greetings. Right. Are you good now? Nobody else is coming in here. You guys are just... I mean, you guys don't know what you want to do. <laughs> right. Everybody else should be going in here now, right? I'd like your thoughts on this. You think they're unhappy? What about these guys? Because they're all stuck going in circles. I mean, I freed them. That's that's important. Right, we can fix this now. Good to see you checking up on things. No more. Right. So, which is the se Oh, yeah. Well, we can replace that one with low security fencing. That can be where the herbivores go. Unfortunately, there's not really else, a lot else that we can do. Do I want to spend another 10,000 on a dig team? Do I. No, I'm not going to look after that while you get a soda. I don't know you're not going to steal the embryos if I do it. Right, let's, get rid of, let's get rid of the Safari, right? So we have no reason for that to be here anymore. Message from the park administrator. This is what we want. The viewing den. Message from Dr. Grant. Uh, yeah. This is good. Is it? <laughs> it doesn't look good. Oh, finally. <laughs> right, one down. It's going to be low, isn't it? Things are good. It's going to be low. Oh, it's high. Nope. I like that. So I think this is now assumed to be a hump, isn't it, rather than a small sail? Because we now know that Acrocanthosaurus, or we believe Acrocanthosaurus, is actually related to this thing. I mean, some say the Spinosaurus had a hump as well, but we can't be sure. 23. We're slowly getting there. We still haven't got, I still don't think we have anything, well, we can't have anything T-Rex because I only just put the dictine there. Message from John One star. So I mean, come on, who doesn't want to come here and see a whole load of cows? I know I would. I'd pay for that. I feel like I should put a toilet over here. Message from Dr. Wu. There we go. <laughs> Hopefully they'll be a bit happier with that. Nine dollars for a balloon. 
Rip off. People in it. Let's change the name. You are awesome. I will give you that. You are a lot more stressed out than the other one. We haven't really seen your eating animation yet. Never got to see it in the uh, the exercise. Or an open range safari. Yeah, they all have that same gulping thing, it's just the Acrocanthosaurus is slower. We all good, we all gonna live for a bit longer. The Acrocanthosaurus, I don't think, are. Well, one of them is. Yeah, I should probably put the hatchery back in. Unfortunately, I'm going to have to keep wasting money with those hatcheries. What's your problem, Warden? Not you. Oh, you're happy again. <laughs> well, if you come up here, I can show you something. In fact, I could show you four things. That was great. I mean, we just barely got his happiness up a bit higher. You're all so lazy. Has anybody ever told you that? Message from John Hammond. Thank you. Very quite satisfied. I got the part racing up, didn't I? I don't think this is actually how park ratings work, but whatever. Welcome. Message from Dr. Grant. I want to know how these things are built from the point of view of the workers. Like, yeah, physically building this thing on the inside. Thanks for stopping by. In mean, Jurassic World Evolution, you, you, you actually see the construction of the buildings. It takes forever. But you can actually see it. Good to see you again. Message from Dr. Sacker. And there it goes. Message from Dr. Wu. Mm. I think the only other one we could can we? Yeah, we can make a rhinosaurus. Probably not much point, but we can do it. Yeah, it's not going to be long until people start complaining, isn't it? It won't be long. Don't want to get rid of these things for now. Uh -huh. Can you good choice? That was a good choice, apparently. <laughs> Welcome to the world. Why are you partially stressed out? I don't even get what the point of that is. Like, why do the why do the big carnivores and velociraptors always feel the need to hunt something just just because they've been born? Hi there. Good to see you again. <laughs> Still losing money. Hello. Yes, come on, guests. Come on in. It's no surprise. It's not surprising that people want to see this. I mean, come on. Why wouldn't you? Okay. Who doesn't want to see this? Look at that. That is awesome. They still sound... I mean, both dinosaurs sound kind of weird. So, why a hiss? Why is that the noise the Carcharodontosaurus makes? And I don't, I don't even know how to describe this thing. It kind of just sounds like it's yawning. 
Again, they both sound a bit more intimidating when they're on a rampage, but... Or fighting something, but not by much. Especially the Acrocanthosaurus. Why another dinosaur would possibly back away from it is beyond me. It sounds... Well, it doesn't sound very intimidating at all. Here it is. Here's the complaining. That, that, that's the balloon tour. Right, well, when... Well, the thing is, Haley. when I can start getting in some DNA for other dinosaurs, then we'll be okay. Same with you, Shane. It's not my fault everybody here wants to hang around the same area. I've literally got three other toilets back here. Two other toilets and yet everybody hangs around this one area because there's a balloon tour here. I feel like I should make another balloon tour. Message from Dr. Grant. Nobody wants to use this thing anymore. Tyrannosaurus is getting there. What I don't know is how much this is going to cost me. I think it's going to cost me a fair bit. Message from Dr. Wu. There. What recommend in this situation? So yeah, this little one will be our herbivore exhibit. I mean, there's... Oh, what is that? That's Parasaurolophus, Taurosaurus, Styracosaurus, Corythosaurus, and Aranosaurus. So yeah, there is quite a few in there. Yeah, of course you do, Stephen. I mean, technically, you are, sort of. Why do their names all change? They're now David Reinhard, Martin Buds, Adam Dyson. Do you think? Nah, it's got to be a coincidence. Dimitri Hacker. Florian. I wish I said Florian from Florida. I know you're from New Zealand. Hi there. Oops. It's a funny looking passport though. Nobody wants to go in this tower, do they? How long can the Aranosaurus live now? Nine months. Still not quite there. We're getting there, but it's not quite there. But my money's going down again. I can hear a noise outside and it's getting on my nerves. I don't know what it is, but it's getting on my nerves. Ah, Oh, they're sleeping together! Oh, that's adorable! That is actually adorable. Sleeping in the heat wave. Ah, I never thought I'd say a Carcharodontosaurus is adorable. 
message from Dr. Grant. It'll say it's a bit of a shame about your evolution forms. And yeah, you can actually transport them while they're sleeping. Just regular sleeping, you can transport them. It's a shame about your evolution design, guys. I don't like the Kakarodontosaurus in evolution. And evolution just makes you a fat thing. Like, they are. The Acrocanthosaurus in evolution is massive. Woo! Hello! Aww. Okay, let's get you out of there now. Good, good, and good. Ah, oh, it actually made the other noise, yeah. So that's the uh, Acrocanthosaurus's other noise. It's like this deep, this deep sound. Why a T-Rex or a Spinosaurus would flee from that is beyond me, but they will. I'm not even hungry. Just killed it for no reason. And then you'll take good advantage of that. Does this count as scavenging? If it's just been killed and it's just watched the other one do it, does that count as scavenging? I would have thought that would count as scavenging anyway. How are you doing there, Tim? Welcome back. It's not Tim Murphy, is it? I don't know, but you're Tim from New Jersey. That's all I know. <laughs> what was that? I mean, I never really bothered to pay attention to my guests that much in terms of the animations. What was that? That looked really weird. Really, I just want one more. Oop. I just want one more Aranosaurus. That's all I ask. Hi. What is currently in the air? Uh, that's the genetics lab. Welcome back. The one time I go there by accident. Spinosaurus, Parasaurophus, Tyrannosaurus, Tyrannosaurus. Uh, <laughs> is that going to be enough though to push it up? Probably not, but let's go with it. For some reason, when Alan Grant's uh, urgent messages are when your genetics lab is full. I'm not sure why that's an urgent message, but that's what we're told. I don't know what happens if your dig team then finds something. <laughs> the cows and goats are the only animals that don't actually have, like, who, whose bodies don't change. Like, they... Um, the dinosaurs do decay over time. They'll, they'll either decay over time or they'll change. Uh, they'll either decay over time or they'll do it faster when they're being eaten. At first, all you hear are just some flies, and then after a while, it will, it goes through like it will go pale. Then some of the flesh will disappear. Then more of the flesh will disappear, and then it will just implode. So yeah, that's your fun little fact about the dinosaurs. About dinosaurs and death. Good choice. I haven't found one bit of Carithosaurus yet. Good to see you checking up. Message from Dr. Grant. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. Yeah, how are you guys doing anyway? Ten months. Message 
message from Dr. Wu. Why is there always still blood even when they clearly don't hit anything? I thought you might like some input here. You can now sort of make Styracosaurus. Why do I keep getting these two menus mixed up? This is not hard to learn. Oh, got money again. Oops. Hello. Hello. Well, there's anything worthwhile in there at the moment. As well. Hi. Oh, someone's not happy. Well, oh, just suddenly they are. <laughs> they weren't happy, and now they are. Except you. Well, now you are. Nadine from Australia. Everybody's happiness keeps going up and down. It's very indecisive. Well, I can't make the Aranosaurus with this much money. It's going to use up half of it just to make the hatchery. Message from John Hammond. Yes. It's pretty much the same thing you told me last time. <laughs> oh, shut up, Graham. What? What is the issue here? See? Carmen's got the right idea. I mean, the thrill seekers will. Is that my radiator or does something just hit my window? It wouldn't surprise me. I've had birds hit my window before. Well, not birds, a bird. It was fine. It was fine. A bit stunned, but it was fine. Camera. <laughs> sometimes it goes over the fence, sometimes it goes through the fence. Nobody wants to use this tower. Why does nobody want to use my towers? Not even you, Pang. You don't want to use it either. By the way, they will put the uh, the balloon into their pocket. It randomly disappears when they go into something. Yes, clearly. They are all very dissatisfied. Oh, no, there it is. Worst holiday I've ever had. Who said that? Who said that? I don't even want you in my park. What should we do about this? Oh, they finally got some Corythosaurus. And it's low. Oh, we do have a bit of Corythosaurus. Okay. Wah, I got a waiting queue for the best ride in the park. You wouldn't last one minute at Disney World. But Disney World doesn't have this, does it? It has a dinosaur ride, right? it has Disney's dinosaur, but it doesn't have anything like this, does it? Message from Dr. Wu. Indeed it was. Beautiful composition. We just need the money to go a little bit higher up, of course. Will you people make up your minds? Message from Dr. Maybe it's sad he's not staying anymore. 
Yeah, they're all getting quite unhappy now. I don't have the price for it because of the, uh, the, the, the price of the hatchery and the Aranosaurus and the feeder and the facilities. <laughs> Means I can't really do a lot at the moment. Nope, she didn't tell me anything. Even Enrico is unhappy and yet this is what he gets to see. How can he be unhappy with Pons seeing this? Look! Flying dinosaurs. They may not be pterosaurs in this game, but there's flying dinosaurs. They fly in the V shape. Welcome back. Oh. <laughs> they all just disappeared. Okay. I don't think a Rhinosaurus costs that much. No, it doesn't. It's only, it's only a two-star dinosaur. Still, the Rhinosaurus, you, you want more than one. Welcome. I don't know why the authenticity is always partially there. Let's just let our crowds arrive one last little bit. Not our crowds, so let our guests arrive one last little time. I read that as Pear for a moment. I was like, why is his name Pear? There's only one of him. He's Paul from Arkansas. Arkansas. Well, right, how much money has he got? Oh, I don't like how much money he currently has. <laughs> I think it's a sign. I also think this is a sign. It's the lost world all over again. Very nice. Hi. See, so, yeah, I don't have nearly as many guests, though. Message from Dr. Grant. Okie dokie. It's good to sit here. Do that. Message from Dr. Wu. And then have one of these. Maybe an arrest area at some point. I thought you might like some input here. Ladies and gentlemen. We are pleased to announce the arrival of a new and exotic herbivore from North Africa. Aronosaurus stands out from the crowd with her colorful sound and fun-loving attitude. Please enjoy this magnificent dinosaur. Hello. Well, your mouth may always be open and I can't unsee it now since it was pointed out to me. Hooray! But you are a hell of a lot better than the Uranosaurus in Evolution. Okay. Jurassic World Evolution. I hate the Uranosaurus in Jurassic World Evolution so much. It is... It's, it's two things. It's kind of cute. They gave it a platypus face. But on the downside, it's, it's texturing really makes it look like it's, it's a rubbery toy. And I hate it because of it. He's very impressed. Oh no, he's, he's the happy one. Look at all of this. Too many people. 42. There are 42 people. In what possible... I would count that as this place being a disaster. Luckily you can't get diseases because everything's researched. Your hatcheries already have the immunization on it. Uh, 
my money's going down again. I feel like I need another park entrance. But nobody wants to come over here. Three of them leaving all in a row. Two. Message from Dr. Graham. Message from Dr. Sackler. And there goes the other. I don't have the money to replace you. Ugh. I really don't. I don't have the money to replace these guys. Message from John Hammond. You wouldn't believe it, though. <laughs> you really wouldn't. Alright, screw it. In the end, your dinosaur should never really need this fencing. But we're also a really long way from getting either of them. We're not getting Spinosaurus anytime soon. We're not getting Tyrannosaurus anytime soon. So we may as well get rid of the fence. Good choice. Let's get another park entrance in. At least whenever they find Kakarotontosaurus, that's not going to happen. Hi. Message from Dr. Wood. Right. Just that. Let's get you out. One of the very first parks I ever made, I did two really stupid things. Actually, I did three really stupid things. I think it was my first park. And, well, the first the first stupid decision I made is I put, I had an enclosure with some Albertosaurus in it, and there was like this one little area of the fence, and I was just, I just thought, okay, maybe they can break out of that. It was just a random little bit of the fence. I know they, they can't even break out, but I thought they might, so... I thought they might, so I put an avoidance beacon in there, and they just kept panicking from it. And I was getting really frustrated because they just kept on collapsing. I'm like, why do you guys keep collapsing? You stop doing this, it's getting really annoying. Because that's all they were doing. For some reason the price is up. So that was silly mistake number one. Silly mistake number two is I put a Carcharodontosaurus and a Spinosaurus in the same exhibit. And they kept fighting. <laughs> they, they would never kill each other. They never go that far. But they kept fighting at first. And then I kept wondering, why do these two keep going on a rampage? I never properly worked that out. But I have a feeling it's because I didn't actually put any food and water in the exhibit. That's probably why. Right, you guys gonna start spreading out now, or am I gonna need another balloon saw? Or are you just gonna actually start using the toilets? Do I even have a reason for these toilets to be here anymore? I get, I put one over here anyway. Go and join your friends. It's good to see you. How's Starachosaurus? 55. Not nearly close enough. Hello. Get rid of you. Get rid of you. Doesn't give me much, but it gets rid of them. Off. Oh, 
Ophelia. 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 I don't know how you pronounce that. Alright, well anyway. I think we can go and end things off here. As the rain comes in. So, hopefully we can now actually just make some progress here. So, I will see you guys.